Welcome to the Tropics House at the United States Botanic Garden Conservatory. I'm Deputy Executive Director, Dr. Susan Pell, and today I'm gonna to talk to you about the jade vine. Up here on the canopy walk, we have this beautiful liana. Liana is just a botanical name for a woody vine. And it has these amazing, amazing flowers. So I picked a few of them here, and you can see why it gets the name jade vine. This plant is in the bean family and as such has a very particular flower structure. So at the top of the flower we can see this large petal here, this one here, that's called a banner. And then it has these two little side petals. These are called wings. And then at the bottom it has this two, these two petals that are fused together and they form, or each of them is called a keel. And if we separate those apart, what we'll see inside are the reproductive structures. So as I am moving this, this plant is actually dropping pollen out of the top here, right on the tip. You can see it, you can see it on my finger right there. It's dropped some pollen. And I'm gonna pull those keels apart and show you these structures. All right, so here is one half of the, one of the keels and one of the wings removed all the way down to the base. And you can see many, many stamens there. In the middle, there's also the style, the part of the female um, structure within the flower. And then at the base of the style, you can see this kind of green bulbous area. That's the ovary in this plant. And they have a really interesting arrangement of their stamens. And that is what's called diadelphus, or nine plus one. And basically nine of the filaments, the stalks of the stamens, are fused together and one of them, this one here, is free. And otherwise, this, the uh, filaments would actually form an entire ring around that ovary, but as it is, they sort of just hold it in kind of a cup-like shape. So that's the structure of a bean family, especially in the um, subfamily Faboidae. Thanks for joining me today, and I look forward to our future botanical adventures.